What was it like? Put yourself on my shoes. No, I'm joking. Uh, it was it was unreal. It was amazing. Um, it was just the feeling, just the love that um, you know this city has given to us, and the support that we've had, you know, for this entire year. It's it's been it's been amazing. Um, you know, just knowing that you know everybody that, that came out and that supported us, whether it was on TV or here, just it's you know just just, just love. It's, it was just lovely. You had no idea about the ring. No idea. So I thought that our banners, it was, was going to be like a half banner, like half Lee, half Lewis, like half zero, half three. So like that was like my cre creative thinking. I was like, oh, so I was like looking up in a raft and I was like, there's a black spot right there. Maybe we'll put it up. Um, but the ring, no, I had no idea. Um, it's, I mean, I'm definitely going to wear it. <laughs> what about your two free throws at the end? I mean, here you are being honored and you got to step up and get two pretty crucial free throws. I mean, uh, <clears throat> you know, shoot or shoot, uh, especially me, you know, I pride myself on free throws. That's one thing that I've done uh, all, all year, um, actually in my entire career. Uh, not nervous or anything? No, nah, not nervous. I mean, even from, you know, going back to my days at Drexel, I actually finished uh, number one all the time. Free throw shoot for Sam So, I mean, free throws and you just you know, for easy points. So, I'm not. What was, what was last night like? Obviously, I saw you guys were dancing earlier today. It seemed like you were pretty loose, but did it hit you last night? Was it going on tonight? Or? A little bit. Um, you know, especially when, you know, I sent Coach that text. Um, <clears throat> it was one of those things where I just wanted, you know, because, I mean, Dylan, Dylan's been, you know, basically one of the team favorites, and Dylan's just so generous and caring for everyone. So I really wanted to, you know, try to honor him and, you know, pay, pay homage to him and really, you know, give up my, my starting spot for him. And it was just one of those things where I think that was when he really hit me, was when I, you know, sent Coach that text about that. What, what are you thinking now? I mean, now you're really, it is coming down to the end. Yeah. 40 minutes. I mean, really just 40 minutes. I mean, I could be 40 minutes. Um, you know, just having this last you know, oppor opportunity against, you know, another top 10 team. Um, for us to, you know, go out and try to go out there and try to get a win. I mean, that's really all we can do. Uh, I don't know for Trey and myself, you know, that this game is really special, but I definitely think that, you know, next game is going to be, you know, you know up there, you know, how, how special it will be because, you know, it's literally our last college game. Why, why is Virginia so hard for you guys to play? They're consistent. They stay the same way. Uh, I mean, they, they're, they're just consistent. They've been the same way, and, uh, Tony Bennett, you know, has started to recruit, you know, guys that have, you know, fit his system ever ever since he, you know, got the job and they've been getting better and better. But I mean really it's just their consistency. They don't they don't change for any team that they play. So, you know, it's just about matchups and reads and you know, in order for us to try to find ways to score. Did you know much about the, that all star game that, that uh, Rick said you're going to? I didn't I didn't know. I mean we we just found out when you guys found out. So, you know, Trey and I we, we were Sitting there, still trying to figure out like what you know this gift or what it was going to be, and then Coach you know announced that, and then gave us the the, the rings, and it was just you know definitely a moment. It's good. It's good. Did you have a speech in your mind that you wanted to to do and? It no, kind of—I uh, didn't know if it kind of took you by surprise when you got the ring, and you know. No, no um, so like with the speech, I mean, I'm, I just go off whatever, you know, whatever, uh, however I feel. And uh, as soon as I saw Trey talking, you know, Trey got done, and then I just looked up. Yeah, you and put me on first the spotlight. Person, <laughs> said, "Go first. I was like, "Oh man, <laughs> that was great." And the first person I saw was my mom, and I mean, that's just obvious. You know, I spotted her, and then of course I have to give her, you know, all the credit for everything. Why was it so difficult? tonight to win that game. They're, they're a tough team. I mean, in, in, in every single game that they've played in, you know, it's been 10 points or less. You know, they've, they've literally fought in every single game. 
Um, and you know they played two big guys, two post players. And for us, we didn't, we couldn't necessarily match up with that, especially once you know, one of one of our guys would get in foul trouble. Could you have ever imagined when you walked here in last April or early May that? Could you have ever even dreamed that it would end up kind of like this with the twists and the turns and the emotions? And uh, yeah, um, I mean, this is, you know, I kind of still think that it's, it's a dream a little bit. You know, I kind of still want to wake up. But it's just one of those things where I think, uh, you know, if you're, if you're a good person, um, you know, good things, good things come your way. And even though that there's some negativity that's happening you know, here, eventually, you know, the good will eventually find its way and, you know, come back to life. So, you know, I definitely, you know, first of all, give thanks to, you know, God for you know, giving me these talents and abilities. And, of course, you know, the list goes on. But you know, if, I fail to, if I fail to mention anyone, just know that, you know, it's 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 because of loss of, you know, thought, not because of what's, you know, in my heart and how it truly feels. Good.